uh, with the times we're living in and the possible lockdowns that may happen again, a lot of people are looking for chest freezers, deep freezers. And um, I went to so many stores and I can never find any. And I think these three display models are the only ones they have at my local Lowe's. I've actually been to several local Lowe's in my area. But I just kind of wanted to show what they look like. Here's a 5.1 uh, cubic foot. This is a hot point. And this one, I believe, is two. It's two something. I, it, the price isn't listed. Um, but this one, this is the size we want to get. Um, this is a seven cubic foot, 7.1 cubic foot, 216. Look at how much bigger two cubic feet is. Look at this. You see that? I know deep freezers are in high, high demand. And now look at the five. Look how much smaller it looks. This is obviously going to be better than nothing, but the two extra, like I said, look at that. It just seems so much bigger. And then this one is 8.8. .8. And to be honest, it didn't seem that much bigger than the seven. This one is a Medea, <laughs> like that movie. And um, all the ones that I'm seeing that are affordable for me at least are manual defrost. Same. I know this is a manual defrost. Again, that's a hot point. It's hot point too. But yeah, does, doesn't the 7 just look so much bigger? And it's only $2.69. And then $3.99. So, trying to get this one. We'll see how it works out. Just called for help. And look at these manuals. I know there's automatic defrost. I know that these ones are all manual. But you see, there's just these little controls here. Power button. Max off. And min just wanted to show these because I've never had a chest freezer before and I really really want to get one especially with two little kiddos and I'll tell you like a couple months ago our store didn't have any meat and like frozen products I need for my kids and it really is scary so I just, just want to get one of these I just think it's a good idea so yeah we just called somebody over so hopefully they have them in stock Look at the lids, these are the same. This is a little bit different. Oh, okay, I think he's coming. Hey, and I just wanted to show this too for the five cubic foot one, the hot point here, it's $26 estimated yearly energy cost. You see these yellow tags, the energy guide. That is kind of important. And for this seven cubic foot, it's $30 estimated yearly energy cost. And then for this 8.8 .8 cubic foot one, it is $26 estimated yearly energy cost. It's kind of important because you don't want anything that's an energy hog. Just found out this 5.1 is 239, 269, 399, but online this one says 359. Always check online because a lot of stores match the prices that their own website has online. Because not all the times their website for that specific store even matches the in-store pricing, which is kind of weird, but whatever. All right, I stopped recording in there because it, <laughs> things got a little bit hectic with everyone trying to um, check out. It's closing in like 10 minutes. I felt bad being there so late, but anyways, at Lowe's, we were finally able to find a chest freezer. We ended up getting the hot point, the 7.1 cubic foot. It's gonna be delivered in a week, and I am going to do a video on that. But yeah, I'm so glad I found one because I have been looking at countless stores online, countless local places, like little mom and pop local places. That was my first choice to buy and nobody had anything. I had been looking for a while, making so many phone calls, Home Depot, Lowe's, just everywhere you can think of. And finally, Lowe's had just gotten a few in that like, today, like the same day. So I'm glad we were able to get one just Oh, you never know. I guess life is crazy now. And, you know, I remember going to the store and there was literally like no meat, no frozen things and shelves were bare. And I have two little ones and just the thought just really, really scares you. So I just want to make sure that I have a little bit extra because my fridge and I, I should do a video on my fridge. My fridge isn't like a small, small fridge, but it's not a big one. I would say it's on the smaller side. I don't even know what cubic foot it is, but the freezer is tiny. 
And when you pack the freezer in a fridge, you will know that um, if you pack it too much, it affects the performance of the fridge. So anyways, we ended up getting that middle one, the hot point one. I am so excited. Let me know down below if you have a chest freezer. If so, what size? And anybody that's currently looking for one, did you have a hard time finding one? Thanks for watching. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe.